hi guys i'm literally about to step out um i'm just waiting for my uber to get here i need to go to um a nearby mall to exchange some shoes that i got that were the wrong size and to run a few errands as well so let's get out of here Why can't you just buy a house? Get yes, that is what uh, that guy said. He said, Can I buy this house? Because after 12 months, I would mm. have spent 12 million. Imagine. He says, That lady says, No, I don't want to sell this house. I want to rent it out. Why? Eh? And you know, you're in the lap of Hello Corner. Hey, oh. Is that in the Malangaga? Why? Hey, no. I know. something that I can wear this weekend um, because we're going to one of the wine farms and I kind of don't have anything to wear hey so like I'm not sure I just wanna look around for something if I find something nice then maybe I'll get that otherwise I'll just have to make a plan but like yeah I'm just gonna look around and see what I can find hopefully I can find something in here i don't know we'll see this is kind of cute i don't know what do you guys think it's kind of cute these blouses are actually quite cute there's like a leopard print one as well and is this one as well so i don't know hey kind of like them i don't want to lie though i wish i could find one that is in like a neutral color that is plain with no pattern i'm very much a neutral girl so i'm having a bit of um OCD about you know the the prints I kind of just wanted to be plain with no prints no design just plain beautiful blouse that's either um, like beige or cream or white you know like a nude color basically that's more my vibe but yeah let's look around and see what else they have to offer
finally done. I got um, most of the things that I was looking for and I was able to exchange the shoes, um, fortunately. So I'm happy about that. And I did also get myself some Krispy Kreme donuts because like I'm just unable to live without them. Um, and these are the flavors that I got today. Let's just see. Okay. Obviously glazed donut goes without saying. I just saw this one. Um, I want to try it. It was my first time seeing it actually. I think it's what? Uh, caramel. What? Yo, I forgot what it's called. Like, can you just don't slip here? Maybe the slip can tell me. Um, lotus full drink. Okay, that's not what it said. Um, on the thingy, it said what? Crispy fold. Uh, caramel crusted something like that though but yeah i have a feeling that this is going to be so delicious plus the weather is really allowing today and always um the milk tart donut as well got that so i'm about to dig into these and i will have absolutely no regrets about it and yeah so I think I'm just gonna settle down now and enjoy my donuts and then just enjoy the rest of the day. This is literally the best thing I've ever tasted. It's beautiful. Yo, it tastes so, so, so good. I wish I bought two more, but yeah, everything in moderation. But I just want you to guys, I just want you guys to know that this, this right here, this right here is the one. Hi guys. So first of all, I changed my hairstyle. Um, as I said that I would, um, and this is the new one. I really like it. And this, this is how I look. I also switched up my color as well um, so it's quite exciting I'm really enjoying this new look anyways right now we are on our way um, to one of the wine farms for a wine tasting experience um, yeah we're just we're on our way there right now and I'm really excited to Enjoy the experience even though today's weather is a bit um, it's a bit dodgy when we woke up in the morning it was literally raining but fortunately it has cleared up as the day has proceeded so at least we've got a bit of sunlight now even though it is still you know cloudy and a little bit gray but you know the skies are also somewhat blue and you know there's a, a bit of sunshine trickling through every now and then so yeah this is us on our way to the wine farm and I'll catch up with you guys when we get there
Make that money throw it in Booty bouncing, gon' go hit Rose for Lamborghini Blue Medina, always beaming Rag top, chrome pipes Blue lights, out of sight Long way, sold in Say it again, sold in Make that money throw it in Booty bouncing, gon' go hit Rose for Lamborghini Blue Medina, always beaming Rag top, chrome pipes Blue lights, out of sight Long way, sold in a combination of Chardonnay yeah, and a Pinot Noir. Yes, mm. um, thank you very much. We appreciate it. Sure. Thank you. Thanks. So what is the sun called again? The one that I'm about to say. <laughs> you were not listening. I was. <laughs> very light texture if I can describe it in another way I'd say 
it's it's like weaker. It's more on the weak side as opposed to wines that are like more strong and potent. This one is not as potent, which is great because I'm not into like very strong wines. I don't like wines that are too potent. For example, I'm not into Merlots because they're extremely potent. So this guy would work perfectly. I also enjoyed the MCC best. So do you still remember why we're not allowed to call it champagne? Yes, because it's only champagne if it's produced in the champagne region in France. Ma'am, 10 out of 10. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay. So this is our 2016 red blend. So it's a blend of two, uh, three different grapes. It's a blend of Cabernet Sauvignon, 80%. 15% of Cabernet Franc and only 5% of Merlot. So all those wines bring a uh, different flavor profile into the wine. So the Cabernet Sauvignon gives more of the structure and the color. And Cabernet Franc gives more of the fruity kind of aromas, like your, your dark cherries, your blackberries in there. And the Merlot gets just more than the taste of the wine as well. So we combine those three just because Cab and the Merlot, around the world, they, were, they are one of the best uh, blends that we can make in the world. And Cabernet Franc just to make the wine more fruitier as well. So we mature for 18 to 20 months. Then after 20 months, we blend everything together. So this one is full body in structure and it's 15% uh, of alcohol. So people always say that in winter, you need a fireplace with a glass of red wine. Mm. I say sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. Because this is more like a fireplace itself. <laughs> yeah. And the last one, it's a Shiraz. Uh, 2016 vintage so our Shiraz block it's that block over here so it's more like a small little vineyard we, okay. only, we only make minimum bottles of 5500 bottles in our 2016 vintage so this one is matured for 24 months 50 percent in a new old french barrel and another 50 percent in the second time. so we we'll try to make it more like a lighter Shiraz type of style we're gonna get some white paper nice bottle of velvet in there as well and this one is 14 percent so this is now the, the Chardonnay that I'm about to taste. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like it or not, but let's see. It smells nice. Wow. This wine is beautiful. It tastes so good. Like it's it's the perfect combination of like fruity and it's not like it's not potent either. You can taste butter in it. Yes, it's smooth like butter. Mm. That's it. It's smooth like butter. Like mm. literally. It just it, it just slides right through. It's beautiful. It tastes so amazing. For me, this is like a definite 10 out of 10. Like I actually like this more than the MCC. Really? Cheers. Mm -hmm. It's actually not that bad. Like it tastes very woody. Um, it I can taste the mellow in it, but it actually tastes quite nice. Like. It's not bad at all. 
actually. Eh? It's not bad at all. Yeah, it's not bad at all. I can. My my palate can handle it. So for that reason, I think it's a really good wine. And lastly, it's another red. Let's smell it first. Lastly, it's another red. Um, one of them is a vintage. I can't remember which of the two, but one of them is a vintage. But anyways, let's taste and see. Wow, it actually tastes good. Like, it actually tastes really, really good. Like, I'm really, really not into red wines, especially the potent strong ones, but these two are actually really, really good wines. And I can literally taste that it has aged, and therefore the taste has become better with time. Maybe that's like one of the mistakes that we do when we consume wine or when we purchase it. We don't take into cognizance the fact that the more it has matured the better it will taste because the better the flavors would have settled in so cheers